Hey guys, today I'm going to show you my random DVDs 2022 version 3, so here we go. First up we got the Spongebob movie collection, or should I say the Spongebob poopy collection. Spy, back, we don't care if it has the Paramount DVD logo in there. Here's disc for the Spongebob Squarepants movie, and disc 2 with the Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water. I don't know why they're both born gray, but we don't care about that. Yeet. Next up, we got Finding Nemo, or should I say Poopy Nemo. Spine, other spine, back. Here's the front, spine, back. Here's disc one and disc two. I don't know what they look like. And we don't care if this movie is THX certified. And I don't care if it has the THX Smooth Can logo on disc one. And I don't care if it has the THX Text logo on disc two. Next we got Iron Man. Or should I say Dopey Man. Spine back. I don't care if it has the Paramount DVD logo. And it's rated PG-13. And I don't care if it has the Paramount DVD logo. Same thing as the Spongebob movie collection. Anyways, here's the disc. And I don't know why it's boring gray. Same thing as the Spongebob movie collection. But we don't care. Next up we got Despicable Me. Or should I say Despicable Poop. Spine. Spine back. I don't care if it has the Universal 1990, 1997 logo in there. Anyways, here's the disc. I don't know why it's orange transparent. Next up, we got cars. More like cars poop. Because this came out before planes. Spine, back. I don't care if it has the THX text logo. Same thing as on Finding Nemo Disc 2. Which is in full screen. And has previews on it. Anyways, here's the disc. And sadly, there's no Disney DVD logo, even though it's on the front and the spine. It is truly sad. Ooh. Get out of here. And sorry if you can hear some background noise. Next up, we got Cloudy with the Chance of Meatballs. Or should I say Cloudy with the Chance of Poop Balls. Spine, back. I don't care if it has the Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo in there. Anyways, here's the disc. And I don't know why the case is white. But who cares? Sorry if my camera wouldn't focus. Alright, now it's focused. Next up we got Iron Man 2. Or should I say Iron Man Da Spy back. I don't care if it has the Paramount DVD logo. Same thing as Iron Man and the SpongeBob movie collection. We don't care if this movie is rated PG-13. Same thing as Iron Man. Anyways, here's the disc. Let me f turn it around so you can see. Here's the disc. And I don't know why it's boring gray. Same thing as Iron Man and the SpongeBob movie collection. Next up, we got Mega Mine. Or should I say Mega Poop? Spine, back. We don't care if it has the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo in there. Here's disc. And I don't know why it's boring gray. Same thing as the others. Next up we got Monster House, or should I say Monster Poop? Spine, back, I don't care if it has the Sony Pictures Home Entertainment logo, same thing as Cloudy with the Chance of Meatballs. Anyways, here's the disc, we don't care. Next up we got Despicable Me 2 Blu-ray and DVD, or should I say Despicable Me Da? Spine, back, we don't care if it has the Universal 2012 logo in there. Anyways, here's the DVD. And the Blu-ray. There's the Blu-ray right there. Sorry if it's taking too long. And the inserts, but I'm not taking it out. And I don't care if the DVD disc is orange transparent. Same thing as the first Despicable Me movie. Next we got Ice Age. Or should I say Poop Age. Spine, back. We don't care if it has the THX, text lo THX Broadway logo in there. There's disc. And I don't care if it has the, excuse me, and, and, and we don't care if it has 
the T is THX certified. Same thing as cars and finding Nemo, but who cares? Next up, we got Kung Fu Panda, or should I say Crack Fu Panda? Spawn back. We don't care if that's the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo. Same thing as Mega Mind. Here's the disc. And sadly, the disc is, has cracks on it and is about to come apart. And I don't care if the disc is born gray, but it is truly sad. Ooh. And I don't care if it's born gray. Same thing as the others. Next up, we got Wreck-It Ralph, or should I say Shrek-It Ralph? Spine back. We don't care if it has a Disney DVD logo in there. And sorry, I accidentally dropped it. But anyways, here's the disc. I don't know why it's going gray, but who cares? Next up, we got Christmas with the Cranks, or should I say Christmas without the Cranks? Spine back. We don't care if it has the Columbia Tristar Home Entertainment logo, even though it says Sony Pictures Home Entertainment on the back. Anyways, here's the disc, but we don't care. Next up, we got Puss in Boots, or should I say Poop in Boots? Spine, back. We don't care if it has the DreamWorks Animation, SKG, Home Entertainment logo, same thing as Mega Mind and Kung Fu Panda. Here's the disc. We don't care if it's born gray. No, 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 no. Next up, we got Captain Underpants, the first epic movie, or should I say Captain Poopy Pants, the over 9,000 first. The over 9,000 if it. Epic movie, spine back. I don't care if it has the 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment logo in there. Here's this. We don't care. Next, we got Kung Fu Panda 2. Or should I say Kung Fu Panda Da? Spine back. I don't care if it has the DreamWorks Animation SKG Home Entertainment logo. Same thing as uh, Puss in Boots, Mega Mind, and Kung Fu Panda. Here's the disc. And I don't, it's boring gray. I don't know why it's boring gray. Same thing as the others. Next up, we got Men in Black. Or should I say Poop in Black? Or should I say Men in Poop? Spine back. I don't care if it has the Columbia Church Store DVD logo, even though it says home video. And it's rated PG-13. Same thing as Iron Man and Iron Man 2. Here's the disc. But we don't care. And next up we have is the SpongeBob... Square Pants, the complete first season. Or should I say, Spongebob Crack Pants, the complete over 9,000 seasons. Spine, back. We don't care if it has the I Crave My Own Workout Routine scene on the Spongebob Muscle Buff Pants episode on Disc 2. And we don't care if it has the backup scene on Pizza Delivery on Disc 1. And I don't care if it has the Paramount DVD logo with two options on disc one and disc two and three does not. It just has the regular Paramount DVD logo. And I don't care if it has the Nickelodeon Fish logo on disc one, two, and three. Anyways, here's... Oh, sorry. I accidentally dropped the the, the, the phone. Anyways, here's disc one, disc two, and disc three. I don't know why they're all boring gray. Same thing as the others. And last up we got is... Spongebob Square Pants Absorting Favorites. Or should I say Spongebob Crap Pants Absorting Least Favorites. Spine, back. I don't care if it has the Nickelodeon Fish logo. Same thing as the complete first season of Spongebob. I'm sorry if my camera's not focusing that much. Anyways, here's the disc. And sadly, there is no Paramount DVD logo, even though it's on the spine. It's truly sad one on the last one, guys. It is truly sad. Ooh. But we don't care about it for the last time. Get out! Okay, guys, that's my random DVDs V3, so bye!